Well, a Latin festival I want to tell you about that keeps growing year after year after year will take place this weekend in downtown Milwaukee. Yeah, it's the 12th annual Cuban Day celebration. And joining us live this afternoon is Marta Bianchini, who is the owner of the Cuban restaurant. Cubanitas. 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 And you, you are here to celebrate this big day Sunday. So what's happening Sunday? Well, we're st first of all, the good thing is that we are opening it up on Sunday. We pushed it to Sunday from 12 to 8. We're going to start with two salsa bands, uh -huh. a Latin Ooh. jazz uh, group, uh -huh. and we're going to end the night with a DJ. So it's going to feel cool. like Miami dancing in the streets. It's going to be breezy just like Miami, no um, rain. We just heard Jesse give us a really good forecast for the event. No, no rain, but just p come prepared just in case. Okay, so while you're preparing the mojito yeah. that I'm looking forward to drinking. First of all, though, can I just ask, mm -hmm. who's your friend here? Well, this is Bella. Right, we want to introduce she's Bella. she's the youngest Cubanita in the family. Ah, okay. <laughs> so we were talking about food before, Charles, um, and this is one of the big highlights of Cuban culture, food. We're always connected with our food. So tell us a little bit about what people can expect to purchase Sunday. Well, we definitely streamline the the food mm -hmm. venue part mm -hmm. of it, and we're just going to sell some limited items. Okay. Our most popular is our Cuban sandwich, the plantains and guacamole. Um, and What's on the sandwich? All the roasted pork, the ham, the cheese, cheese. pickle, mm -hmm. and mustard on the Cuban bread. Mm -hmm. Otherwise, it's not a Cuban. <laughs> That's right. Okay. And um, instead of having everybody come inside this year, oh we're going to do it from the window, the line outside, uh -huh. and we're going to have the the Cuban, the guac and chips, the um, rice and beans with the choice of the meat. Okay, so I know, I know where this is. Now you tell everybody else where this festival will be. Located downtown, 728 North Milwaukee Street between Wisconsin and Mason. And as far as parking, there's the interstate parking mm -hmm. um, up on the street. There's the 411 building. Or just and Uber. And Exactly. Yeah. Very smart. Yeah. You don't even have to it. worry about parking. Love and you it, can have it. a drink. You can have food. And I wanted to say, I was at the yeah. last year's event. And you are smart by having all this food on the outside. Because if you don't get there early, you will miss out and not eat. And this is great food. Well, we're prepared to serve 2,000 oh, people wow. this year. How? So we Bella, are ready. What's your favorite? Mine is the beef empanada. Uh huh. And do you help make any of it? No, no. not yet. How many plantains have you seen at the restaurant lately in, in pre preparation for Sunday? A lot or a little? A lot. <laughs> a lot. <laughs> How many cases, Mom? 30. So people coming down there, what can they experience in terms of, uh, so they can, they can buy food, they can get mm -hmm. things to drink, and then they can just enjoy the inter entertainment? Right, the festival itself it's fr is okay. free. It's something that we've been doing the last 12 years as a thank you to our customers for not only supporting um, Cubanitas, but our, our company, uh, the Bianchini Experience, and we own several restaurants in town. And it's just a thank you, and it's just a great way to start off the festival season here in Milwaukee. And, um, and Bella, what is your favorite thing to do there? Mine is the Bouncy House. I was going to ask if the Bouncy House was coming back this year. So it really it is. is a family-friendly event. It, it sure is. So we're going to have a face painter, the, the Bouncy House, um, maybe some cotton candy. And again, it's great. You don't have to be Cuban, but everybody's Cuban for this I one agree. honor. For one day, right? Yes. Yep. We're going to get a lot more, and I'm going to taste your Marta and Bella, thank you very much.